how you doing me babe welcome back to another video if you are new here my name is adrian or you can call me aj and welcome to my channel and honey in this video we have the clean girl makeup look if you cannot tell i am very excited to do this look i feel like it's very similar to my basic babe makeup look these products are affordable this is drugstore i do a lot of drugstore products here at this channel only because i just have a lot of bad experiences with high end if y'all have any advice put them in the comments let's meet in the comments don't be shy say hi a lot of the products makes my skin burn so i tend to go for the drugstore honey go for the drugstore the drugstore products they get the job done my highlighters are high end that is the only high end product that i love to use are highlighters everything else drugstore honey so in this video we have the clean girl look everything is affordable everything is drugstore this is no foundation this is concealer and mascara and the highlighter and all of the all of the things the girls love jump right into the video and i will see you guys in the next one and for this clean girl look we're gonna keep it minimum right now i am moisturizing my face y'all know what i moisturize my skin and my face with um just the elf pure skin line that is the only products i use on my skin and my face because i want like more of a glow because it, it is some of course and i want a, like that glow like that natural glow and of course y'all always make sure y'all put y'all um sunscreen on now this product is the elf plus glow radiant moisturizer with coconut and hyaluronic acid spf 15. and this this just gives your skin like a little bit of a glow this is a moisturizer and spf and so you really didn't need like the moisturizer under it because this is all in one but you know just a little extra I didn't put much on at all. And you just wanna make sure your base is nice and moisturized. Nice and moisturized. Of course, I did my skincare um, routine before. Make sure y'all moisturize in that neck as well. One of the things I love to do is I love to fill in my pores because I have really, really big pores. I have really big pores. Now, I'm going to use the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Mattifying Primer and Sunscreen. It has clay in it for normal to oily skin. And this is my very first time using this. So, we're going to open it up together. And we're just going to put it in these places here. I think it, and a little bit on my nose. Y'all, did y'all listen to um Drake album? Y'all let me know what y'all think about his album. <clears throat> I like it. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I like the album. It's different. It's something to jam to or whatever. You got that little... It's something to jam to. I like it. Now for all over my face. Holy Grail. Y'all see it's almost gone. I gotta pick up another one. Holy Grail. Do you hear me? Holy Grail. Power Grip Primer by e.l.f. Then I'm just gonna put... Listen. You just need very minimal. A little bit. That's all you need. It's a little bit. I call this, they call it the clean girl look. I call it the minimal look. So now that the primer is on, we're going to start with the number one thing. Oh, and this is no foundation. Are these concealers now the thing with concealer is you're literally going to conceal you're going to conceal so y'all see I have this here and I'm going to use this the rich cocoa in the areas that I don't want to highlight I'm going to use this let me see put it a little bit around my mouth My smile lines, y'all see them? Yeah. And I'm just looking in my mirror here. I have two mirrors. I have one behind you and then one directly down. That's it for this. Now to highlight, I'm gonna use the Elf Concealer Rich Chocolate 16 Hour Camo Concealer Matte Finish. A little bit there, a little bit there, here. Here. 
little bit here. Align down the bridge of your nose, and I'll tell you why we do that. It's gonna create a natural contour. Here, then a little bit here. That's it, that's it y'all. Now we are going to what? Blend, 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 blend. To make sure everything is blended, these are damp beauty blenders target. Just to make sure everything is seamless. All right, so Beyonce's new song is We Still Blending. Beyonce's new song is called Break My Soul. Y'all go ahead and YouTube it real quick. YouTube it. And let me know when y'all die. And put it in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about it. Let me know what y'all think about it. Because I like it. I like it a lot. So we still blend it now. Notice I am I only put concealer towards the center of my face. And I'm gonna tell y'all why. It creates a natural contour. You are, now what we're gonna do is since this has set just a little bit, we're gonna blend that out. Starting with the forehead. And you want to make sure that concealer sit just a little bit under the eyes so it can get tacky, of course. And make sure you're blending to where you don't see any harsh lines. Everything should blend seamlessly. Now we're going to do the bridge of the nose. Now, this is a concealer beauty blender by elf it's clean it's just stained these are only six dollars girl go pick you something up now we're going to do the concealer around the eyes actually i want to use I forget where I got. I know I got it from Target, but I forget. It's some type of concealer brush. And you blend going up because it creates a natural snatch eye. Ah. And the reason why you see beauty gurus y'all y'all know i'm kind of country so beauty gurus looking every which way when they are blending out the concealer underneath the eye is because to make sure it gets in every crease and crevices of the eye and what i want to do is i'm gonna put a little bit more right here because i have a deep set under eye so i'm just gonna put a little bit more let it sit And with the concealer I just put on, I'm going to go a little bit over my eyelid. Same with this one. Now, girl, listen, I'm just going to take that same beauty blender and blend the entire face. Just making sure everything is blended seamlessly together. 
And if you feel like you need a little bit more concealer somewhere, by any means, go ahead and do what you want with your face. I tend to not use any foundation. I just feel like for right now, especially when it's summertime, you just don't need all of those products in your face. Not for an everyday clean girl look. Now, if you want full glam, honey, by any means necessary, do what you got to do. But for a clean girl, everyday clean girl look, honey, you don't need all that. Boom, the base is complete. I did just get my brows done, but I just want to highlight a little bit underneath the brow. So I'm just going to take a little bit here and heat my hair brush. Boom. In doing this, ladies, this just creates more of a freshly waxed brow. And bring that down to the the lids as well. Freshly waxed brow, honey. Freshly waxed brow. <laughs> so we're gonna do the same with the other one. Let me tell you something. I might not know how to do a full glam look yet, but when it comes to this everyday, basic babe, clean girl look, I really feel like I got that damn pack. Do you hear me? Beginner friendly, drugstore friendly. Like, I really believe that. Now that you have blended all of that into the lip, we're going to take that same concealer blender and we're just going to blend it. Making sure, making sure everything is blended seamlessly together. Now, <clears throat> because you want everything to be set into place, you want to put a setting powder. Now, I have a couple. So I like the L'Oreal Infallible Blue Setting Powder. I love this one. I absolutely love the Black Opals. This one is the... I want to say this one is a soft velvet. Yep, this one is a soft velvet. I absolutely give you like that soft look at it. So what we're going to do, we're going to set all of the places we put concealer. So dip that in there. Blow it. And then just literally pat all the places you put the concealer. Y'all see the lines here? I'm gonna show y'all how to bring that out. That natural contour. And we have not even put in on contour yet. We have it. Because I still see a little bit of my under eye. I seen this trick, y'all. I seen this trick here on YouTube. And I forget what, what page or whose channel I was on. But you take some more of that powder and you see where the line is, you go directly on that line. Now, all you are doing now is making it pretty. Literally, you're just gonna make it pretty. So, one of the things you can do to make it pretty is what? That's right, blush. But hold on, let me show y'all how to get this natural. Y'all see that? Y'all know what I love to do with that. We're not taking a contour, we're gonna take a sculpting powder, and y'all already know Old Faithful. Okay, y'all already know Old Faithful. Let me use this angled fluffy brush. An angle fluffy brush. Just take a little bit of that. Y'all see? Blow it. Blow it. And go here. And we're literally sculpting. Okay. 
literally sculpting. You're sculpting out the shape that you want everything. You're bringing dimension, warmth back into the face. This is not hard at all, y'all. Listen. You're sculpting out how you want your the nose to look. I have a wide nose, so I do. I like to narrow out my nose just a little bit. I love my wide nose. Don't get me wrong. I love my wide nose, but when I'm doing my look, I like to sculpt it out just a little bit. You know, narrow it out just a little bit, and I do that with sculpting. Now, listen. In my first video, I did this with contour. A contour, um, that con the same contour that comes in the palette. It's just a little too dark for me. It's just a little too dark for me. And so, you know, you know how us girls do. We like to play in makeup. And so I'm like, hmm, I wonder how it would look if I just use the sculpting powder, the sculptor. It, did, it gave me everything it needed. I needed. It. it gave me everything that I needed. It, it gave me what I needed. It didn't give me that harsh, you know. I, I'm gonna try to put. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna try to put the clip in here of when I mess up on my first look. I'm gonna try to put the clip right here. I'm gonna try to put it right here. And how I had to go in and kind of fix it and, girl, like just no. Because my thing is, if you're in a rush, you just don't have time to do all that. You just don't. That right there, take that same beauty blender, bounce it, just make sure there is no harsh lines and Now you can go a step further and take, um, where's my favorite little, I got this, oh here it is, this big old angled brush. You can take it a step further, dip it into the same sculptor and put it like here. We wasn't doing that today y'all, but forget it. For the sake of the video, we'll bring some warmth back into the entire face. Just for the sake of the video, cause I love y'all. You can take it a step further. Take a little bit, a little bit of that that um contour, y'all. I'm scared of contour. You can mess that up quick, just a little bit. And if you wanna, like right here, right here, just to create the illusion of a slimmer face. Y'all see how I did that? Right here. Y'all see that? Another thing y'all know I love to do, and I'm gonna keep it drugstore just for the sake of this video. You can go ahead and use this highlighter here. It works just as well as any other highlighter. It works just as well. I just like to take a little bit of highlighter and put it down the center of the nose, down the bridge of the nose and on the button of my nose. Y'all know I love a highlight, okay? I like to go a little heavy on the highlight, especially in the summertime. I just like that glow. Like, I just love that glow. But y'all be careful with your highlighter because, y'all, if y'all mess up on your highlighter, whatever that highlighter is, it's going to stick. It's going to stick. Now, my last child. I'm going to take a, this Wonder, Wondrous Escape palette. And it is a color, it's a highlighter, and it's... It's a, this is a, a eyeshadow palette, but it's a color in here called Santorini. And I just love using that palette. I love using that color as a highlighter. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Take a little bit of that on a fluffy brush and just do like that. Y'all see how that automatically that did that? I'm going to take a little bit on my finger. Just a little bit. Because once again... This is Minimal Clean Girl. Y'all see how I did that? Y'all see how it brings everything together like towards the nose? And I'm gonna take some more on that fluffy brush and I'm gonna put it 
on the highest point of my shoes. And I like to bring it up as well. Y'all see how it's doing that? Same as, same as the other side. Now, y'all, if y'all want to get just a little extra, y'all see that? I just love that. I love that for the winter summer girl. I love that. I don't care. Every I just I just love that. I just feel like for me and you know <clears throat> a lot of a lot of the we don't see how lot of much anymore. I know I don't. I don't see how lot of much anymore, but I'm I'm still addicted to highlighter. I don't care what you say. In the in the winter time, maybe not so much. In the summertime, girl, that glow. Okay, <laughs> but I'm what I like to do now is I love to take a little bit on the fluffy brush. It could be whatever fluffy brush, but a little bit on the underneath the brows. Nah, y'all, y'all ain't noticed I, I have not done, I have not touched my brows yet. I have not touched my brow. And I like to bring it just a little bit here as well. I'm just gonna put just a little bit more. I'm gonna put just a little bit more, I promise. And then I'm done. <laughs> and then I'm done, girl. You can take it just a little bit further and do you a little bit of blush. Shall I do it? Y'all, I'm afraid of blush. I just am. I just, I'm, I'm afraid of blush. Blush. Now, I like to take an angled, <clears throat> a bigger angle fluffy brush. Y'all see it's blush on there already. And this is the Milani's, I forget what, I'm going to link it down below. But it's this, it's this shade. It's gorgeous. This is the only blush that I use. The only blush that I use. I'm honestly, I'm not even gonna hold you. I'm scared of any other blush. I like to take it on the highest part, right under, a little bit on top of <laughs> the highlight. And I like to bring that up as well. A little bit on the nose, right on top of the highlighter. This is another thing you can do with the same blush. A little bit of it. And just sweep it across your lid. have naturally thick brows I have naturally thick brows and so I don't like to do much to my brows but what I do love to do honey I found this not mind you I have been looking for the elves um brow wax I think it's called the elves brow wax I cannot find it in Target I cannot find it in Walmart I have been looking for months it has been sold out on the website for months now elf I am an elf fanatic Okay, come come sponsor your girl. Y'all products, you guys' products are the only like skincare products that sell yourself, girl. Listen, Elf have great products. I can say I have like four or five of their toners. The only skincare line I use for my skincare regimen, y'all know the Elf Pure Skin line. That is the only line I can use. When I tell you, it don't let it don't make my skin burn. A lot of the things, a lot of things make my skin burn. My skin and my face burn. And when I tell y'all that Elf Pure Skin, anyway. So I'm gonna go in with Shape and Stay Brow Pencil. 
by elf this is literally a brow wax i i used it already yeah. this is a brow wax now what i like to do is i like to take it all over my brows all over my brows be careful because we did just um put a little bit of concealer on it now you do that you take a brow brush and you just brush them into place you brush them exactly how you want them to look Now to like seal all of that in, I do love to take. I'm I'm addicted to this as well. Cover girls, easy breezy brow. I'm addicted to this, and I feel like this is just like a sealant. It does the exact same thing, but it freezes everything into place. And you just want to take it all over the brow. Do it real nice and slow, just to ensure the entire strand of the hair, the into all of the brow is covered with the um the product. Because this is, this is going to freeze it into place and grow. Everything is going to stay all day. I'm telling y'all. I'm not doing lashes with this look at all. I my favorite drugstore mascara is the Cover Girls Exhibitionist, and it, it, this is just extreme black, and it looks just like this. I opened this up in one of my vlogs. Uh, hopefully the vlog. I think this video will be out before the vlog is out. So, and I just feel like this is a new one. I have an old one. Should I use it? No, I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna use. I'm just gonna use the new one. And this is exactly how it looks when it comes out just like that and just it just does something for the lashes so we're going to do take your time girl Y'all see that? Can y'all see it? I love that. Now y'all, okay, y'all know I'm extra. I have, and I love that inner glow look. I just love to look like I'm glowing from within. So, what I like to do is I like to top everything with the Dewy Satin Spray by Elf. What's up, Elf? What's good? What's good, Elf? No, <laughs> but I do like to top everything with the Elf Dewy Setting Mist. Dewy Setting Mist, and it looks just like this. And it comes out so fine. It just comes out so fine. And I like to put Stay All Night Micro Fine Setting Mist on top of that. This smells so good. It smells so good, girl. It just comes out so good. How y'all do that? Okay. But go ahead and I like to dry everything as well. Last step. <laughs> we almost done. Lips, honey. Lips. Do just like this to like kind of blend it out a little bit and go and this is the and what these are so old y'all these are the NYX lingerie push-up and this is the color girl what color is this um mm, teddy so teddy and I just like to go in the middle
Boom. Physician's formula, and this is just a diamond plumper, so it's, it's a lip plumper. Okay, so guys, I am done with this video. This is my everyday clean girl look. This is drugstore. This is affordable. This is no foundation. This is concealer. This is very free products. I'll link everything below. And I will see you guys in the next video.